Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this error. That is your Windows 7 system is too outdated. Please install KB4534310. To fix this, copy all the links one by one. So you have to copy these links. Copy the first link first. So copy this link, open this link in a browser. It will take you to Microsoft website. Now over here, first of all, you have to check what kind of system you have. So if you have 64 bit operating system, then you have to download this servicing stack update for Windows 7 X64 base system. So download this. Now if you have 32 bit operating system, in that case, download this, that is X86 base system. So for 32 bit, download this. For 64 bit operating system, download this. So download this and then run this. Click on this blue hyperlink, run this file and then install the update. Click on it and let the installation complete. And after this, copy the second link. This link is also provided in the video description. Open this link in a browser. It will again take you to Microsoft website. Now over here, if you have x64 base operating system, it's showing me in different language. So let me copy this once again. Now, over here, if you have 64 bit operating system, then download this file. If you have 32 bit operating system, then download x86 based system file. So download this and then download this and let the download complete. Once the download is complete, you have to click on this file and install, install the update. Now after the update, you will see a restart option. So restart you can be Now copy the third link. And then again showing different language so keep on opening it till you see English language now again over here if you have 64 bit operating system in that case you have to download this x64 base system download this if you have 32 bit operating system in that case you have to download x86 based file so most user has 64 bit operating system so you can download this and then once the download is complete, you have to again click on this blue hyperlink. And once the download is complete, you have to run this file, click on it, install it, and then go for fourth link. Now over here, also over here, if you have 64 bit operating system, then you have to download this x64 base system file. If you have 32 bit operating system, then you have to download x86 file. So download this, click on download again, click on this blue hyperlink and let the download complete. Once the download is complete, run this file and then install the update. And if you see the restart option, then make sure that you restart your computer after this. Now for all the links after installing for 64 bit, after installing x64 for 32 bit, after installing x86, still you are facing the problem in that case for each update for each update for all the links for each update you have to you can try installing the embedded one so let me show you so here you can see for x64 based system embedded one so for 64 bit download this for 32 bit download this so first of all, you simply try to install x64 bit, the normal, the standard file. If that does not work, you can go for embedded for each update. And for the last update, there is no embedded over here. Yeah, here you can see embedded one. So first of all, you have to download the standard one. If that does not work, you can download the embedded one and then restart your computer and then check. Still, you are facing the problem. In that case, you can upgrade to Windows 10 or Windows 8. You can follow, you can open this link and you can upgrade to Windows 10 or Windows 8 and then check. 
so that should fix the error so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel